James Watt invented the steam engine. Um, and, and that's where the steam turbine comes from. You run steam through it and it, it makes power, okay? Um, Archimedes, the perhaps apocryphal story is he had the Greek warriors hold up their brass shields on a hill, hillside, each of them focusing the reflection on an enemy ship, which concentrated the sun's energy on the ship. It burst into flames. Um, so that's what a solar thermal power plant does. It's not just about making hot water when people have um, solar hot water systems on their roofs in, in some areas. It's about concentrating the sun's energy enough, several hundred times typically, so that you can heat something up high enough to make steam, and then using that steam to drive a steam turbine to make electricity. And one of the best kept secrets in the, the renewable energy business, and something I didn't even know about until a few years ago, for the last 17, 18 years, we've had 350 megawatts of solar thermal power plants running, happily, reliably running in the Mojave Desert in Southern California. They were built in the late 80s. Um, the company that built them then went bankrupt when the price of natural gas plummeted and federal uh, subsidies went away. And that field went dormant for 15 years. It started to come back over the last few years, but what isn't happening yet is very much in the way of what I would call real research on how could we build those kinds of systems, but do it much more cheaply. And as I said, it's not necessarily about exotic materials um, like you might want for a more efficient solar panel. It's about how can we design and build this system so it's reasonably reliable, but uses half the steel, half the glass, um, runs more efficiently, and, and so on. And so looking at that kind of engineering innovation. On the solar side, we've invested in two concentrating solar, sort of called solar thermal um, companies, um, a company called eSolar and a company called BrightSource. Both of them are working on um, a, a configuration of a power plant that is, has been called a power tower. The idea is that you have a, a, a tower surrounded by mirrors. The mirrors swivel to track the sun, and um, just like Archimedes' soldiers, they, they, as they track the sun, ensure that the sun's rays are, are um, directed at that tower. And so as the, the light gets concentrated on that tower, there's a receiver there that heats up. And then you can use that to make steam and drive a steam turbine, or possibly in some other way, maybe you don't use steam, use some other um, fluid to drive a turbine to make, make electricity.